afternoon all. Now I was just soldering up some uh, connectors for my solar experiments and my Weller 60 watt iron, I think it's 60 watt, it was certainly drawing 60 watts, um, started to make a really horrible smell and this bit of the plastic here on the handle was actually hotter than this bit down here which shouldn't be the case so I'm going to take this apart and uh, see if I can see what's wrong. Well, I can see what's wrong immediately. There's some nasty gunk oozing out of a capacitor which says 0 0.01 microfarads and it's all cracked on the side and it smells bad. Now I'm assuming that this is temperature controlled and this thing here is some sort of uh, temperature switch because it's in uh, positive, uh, live comes in here, goes through whatever that is, comes out, goes to this point here, and that then goes to the other um, heating element wire. So it's definitely a switch. So I would imagine that capacitor is just sitting there taking out switching noise. Um, so I could probably just take it out and just accept that I will get a bit of switching noise. I'm hoping that's the case anyway. Otherwise, this thing's for the bin. So I'm going to cut that out, actually, and uh, see if it'll work without it. So that's the uh, capacitor cut out. Um, we should be all right. This moves on that spring. I wonder, actually, whether this is one of these irons where the length of the tip dictates the power. Um, don't know. Perhaps uh, if someone knows about these things, that would be very useful. So, I've removed the little capacitor, put the thing back together. Seems to be getting hot and it's clicking, so I guess it's um, switching on and off. Let's check the power. So it's drawing 55 watts, which is fine. That doesn't seem to be a problem. I wonder if that goes down. Oh, yes, it does go down. I just heard a click, and that's gone to zero. Presumably, when it clicks back on again, that'll go back up. So I can't imagine it's going to miss this capacitor, really. I think it'll be fine without it. So this Weller soldering iron, it, it, it is 60 watts. It's printed on the end there, 60 watts, 240 volts. Um, must be about 30 years old, I guess, this now. Yeah, I must have got it in 1985 when I first started working for liner type, and they gave out toolkits back in those days. Very generous. So that must be 30 years old.